Hey everyone, if you're using Rewired from Guavaman Enterprises, you know it's a fantastic tool, but it lacks the ability to easily put an icon with your actions. So now we've got Reiconed from Null Save to set that up for you quickly and easily. So if we look here, we can see that we have a set of actions set up for a bunch of different controllers. And in our scene here, We've got some text, some blank icons, and a single new script added to the input manager. Let's hit play and have a look. Immediately, you'll see that your actions are replaced by the icons for the keyboard. And if we go ahead and plug in the controller here, we can see them switch in real time to the correct controller icons. Here we have the Xbox, and if we swap out real quick, it goes back to the keyboard, and now over to the PlayStation controller. This is a nearly zero setup solution for you. Just add re-icon and drag in any of the controllers that you want to support. We natively have desktop, both Joy-Cons, the Switch controller, the PlayStation controllers, and the Xbox controllers already mapped and given icons for you. And if you don't like artwork, or you want to add your own artwork in, that's easy too. All you need to do is bring in a image asset that's a power of two size so that you can generate mipmaps. Bring that into uh, different cells and create a test text mesh pro uh, sprite asset. From there, you can simply duplicate one of our existing maps and replace the input with whatever it is that you like. We have 129 keyboard and mouse images available for you, as well as images for every button on the PlayStation, Nintendo Switch, and Xbox controllers. Adding this in is a really simple way to bring your game to the next level. So if you have a static text, you can go ahead and use the re icon TMP action script on it. And this is a very simple script. You just put in the action name that you want to monitor. Oh, I'm sorry, this is for the images. So the re icon image action, uh, put in the um, action name that you want to monitor. We map that backwards from the action name all the way to the input name and put up the image for you. You can even supply a default image if no action is defined on that controller. On a regular text mesh pro, you can do the re icon TMP action, where you can supply an action name, a format for the text, uh, action in curly brackets is replaced with the icon, and a no uh, a text to supply if no action is found. But what if you're using something where you reuse the text mesh pro or you're using localization? Well, we've got a script for that too. As you can see, when I update the text here, it automatically replaces the action name with the correct icon. And for that one, all you need is the re icon TMP monitor. And that will automatically monitor the text mesh pro for uh, curly brackets, action, colon, and then the action name and replace that with your icon. So in less than five minutes here, we've walked through everything in this asset showing you how to set it up and you are ready to go with switching controllers and images in no time flat with rewired and re-iconed for rewired. We hope you enjoy it.